I do much wonder how one man, seeing how much another man is a fool when he dedicates his behaviors to love, will, after he hath laughed at such shallow follies in others, become the argument of his own scorn by falling in love. And such a man is Claudio. I have known when there was no music with him but the drum and the fife, but now would he rather hear the tabor and the pipe? I have known when he would have walked ten mile afoot to see a good armor, but now would he lie ten nights awake, carving the fashion of a new doublet? He was wont to speak plain and to the purpose, like an honest man and a soldier, but now he is turned orthography. His words are, are a very fantastical banquet. Just so many strange dishes. Am I to be so converted and see through these eyes? I cannot tell. I think not. I will not be sworn, but love may transform me into an oyster. But I give my oath, until he have made an oyster of me, he shall never make me such a fool. One woman is fair, yet I am well. Another is wise, yet I am well. Another virtuous, yet I am well. But Till all these graces come in one woman, one woman shall not come in my grace. Rich she shall be, that's certain. Wise or I'll none. Virtuous or I'll never cheapen her. Fair or I'll never look on her. Mild or come not near me. Noble or not I for an angel. Of good discourse, an excellent musician. And her hair shall be of what color, please God.